up y'all it's Liv here welcome back to my channel now if you guys haven't already don't forget to but today you guys we are back and ready to go and we are here to do none other than a random Walmart haul. I just thought to do this because of the fact that I was in Walmart and then I saw a lot of random cool stuff and then I was like, hmm, maybe you guys would wanna see what Walmart has to offer. So here we go. Okay, you guys, so to get started, I wanna show you guys all the different stuff I got just so we can go over and then we're gonna actually use all the stuff I got too. First off, don't judge me because I know I look busted right now, no nails, my hair is a mess and no makeup on, but that's okay. That is okay. Self love. Anyway, we're gonna start off with my favorite thing of what I got today, which you guys are gonna be shooketh to the core. Ready? For bam! Oh yeah. So this is the Kiss Masterpiece One of a Kind Lux Manny. Now, as you guys can see, this is kind of based off of the stiletto styled nail. I really, really love these. Like you guys. I'm gonna show you the video of me walking through Walmart and picking all this stuff up, and I was literally the most excited about these. Impulsive Walmart virus, part one. A yoga mat. Ooh, makeup. Ooh, this looks cool. <gasps> Yo. I didn't even know they had these. That's crazy. And they really do look realistic, so I can't wait to try these on and see if they are approved or not. Next up, I thought to get this random thing. Ba bam A yoga mat. I know. But um, it was on sale, and it was $4. So I decided, you know, I need to stretch, and I need a yoga mat. So that was one of the things on my list too. And I went over to the makeup section because I mean, you guys, this is a beauty channel. So you knew I couldn't have gone too far from the makeup side. So I thought that we should do something different. We decided to get, ba bam face mask. Now this is a really cool set. This is the Spa Scriptions. It has clay, deep sea minerals and charcoal masks in this and it even gives you the little um, applicator. I love this just because this was only $6 at Walmart. You get three in one, that's $2 per one of these little things. So eh, you weigh it out, it's not too bad. The plus side of this is the fact that it comes with the brush, just saying. Now lastly, I got this little number, Boboom. And this is the Milani Green Goddess, which I mean, they already got me when they said goddess, like. Hello. This is supposed to be something new. I have never seen this before. So I, when I walked into Walmart and was like, ooh, this looks kind of cool. Apparently it has cannabis sativa seed oil in it. But we're gonna see how this feels. This is just a lip balm, you guys. Um, my lips are super dry right now. Y'all can not see and do not judge me for my pimple. I'm so sorry. Like that's why I'm not wearing makeup today. Cause I'm trying to do a full cleanse of the face and trying to get my crap back together. I am not looking cute today, y'all. But anyway, we're gonna try this out because if I'm gonna use all my facial products, and if I use this mask, I'm sure that I'm gonna need some type of moisturization at the end. So I think this will be a perfect little additive. This was $9.58, so I guess like $10 after tax. A little pricey for a lip balm, not gonna lie. We're gonna try it out today. I'll let y'all know if it's worth it, okay? And that is it. I didn't get a whole bunch, you guys. I know you were probably expecting like this whole like basket full of stuff. Um, I'm broke. <laughs> just to let you know. So we're gonna start off small. I got us like one, two, three, four items today. We're gonna try them out. Even the yoga mat, I'm gonna lay it out so y'all can see how firm it is. And if you want something like this, because I mean, it is on sale at Walmart. So if you are a yoga junkie or if someone who wants to get into stretching at home or something like that, I mean, what better time than now to say it. All right, y'all. So I want to start off by applying my Bad B nails. I just because, I mean, if we're going to be doing this video the rest of the time, y'all might as well see how fire these nails turn out. So let's crack these babies open. I love these. Like, I'm going to give y'all the extra little look. Like, look at that marble. I think that's really pretty. And I know it's like a trend right now that everyone's like buying these press nails from online and stuff and off Instagram. So I wanted to show some cool alternatives to even that because I know people hate waiting so long for those to show up. Why not get something just as amazing from your local Walmart? 
I'm just saying. So it gives you the glue already, that's great. So it gives you extras, got your little nail file. I'm probably gonna push my cuticles back first just because I know that's what you're supposed to do. Um. Done, okay. Now that you got your nail file and your cuticle pusher, you wanna use this to push back your cuticles. Do not look at my nails, they are trash. You also wanna clean under them. Like I always just do a little swipe because you don't wanna start off with stuff already under your nails before you put your press-ons on. All right, y'all see this? That's actually pretty fire so far. Two on. All right, y'all. So we are finished with the nails and you are not gonna believe how these look. Boom. They are freaking beautiful. Like, hello, these are better than some of the nails I get done for $50. I spend $50 every two weeks on my nails usually when I get them done. And hello, uh, oh. This was literally like pin max with tax. These are worth it. It had different ones. Like these are just like super long ones. If you guys are super into gel or any like the softer tone styled nails, they have them all. I really like the stiletto look. Now we're gonna move on to the next portion. I wanna you go ahead and use this lip balm. My lips are super dry and I wanna try this out now that we got my bad B nails on. Y'all don't have to stare at me being too ugly the whole time. So really great packaging so far. I really love Milani. Like they're already a brand that I mess with already. Green's my favorite color, you guys. Look at that. Just so pretty with that ombre. It says it's a transforming lip balm. So I want y'all to be the judge if this is actually transforming or not. Okay. Let me know if my lips look transformed. Mmm. Y'all, hmm. soft, like, I know my lips still are like dry lips, but wow. Wow. It's already making like this one spot of my lips that was super dry, like kind of go away, which is great. So what do you think? I mean, I feel pretty transformed, not gonna lie. I don't know. What do you guys think? It feels really good. You know chapstick can be very waxy. You can tell this is oil based just because like my lips, they look like they have oil on them. This looks like it is seeping into my actual skin. It's not doing that weird film thing, which I really appreciate. So overall, I think this is a really good investment. I'm definitely gonna keep it, Um, but yeah, Milani, you guys. This was also almost $10. Like I said, a little pricey for lip balm, but now you guys at least can see what you're gonna get for it. Now, I really wanna try this face mask. I don't know which one to try, you guys. I don't know which one is gonna be the one for me. I don't know which one, if I should use all of them. Now the Dead Sea Mineral Mask is formulated with a unique blend of salts and minerals from the Dead Sea in Israel. Ooh! Mm. That just got me. This gentle treatment draws out dirt and impurities of your skin and peels away dead skin cells. It helps restore elasticity, fortify the skin with essential moisturizers. I wanna try something different for y'all. So I guess let's do the Dead Sea Minerals. You know what? I said it the first time and I need to stick to my gun. So let's do that because overall, I think that's the most unique one. It's, I've never tried anything from the Dead Sea at all. So time to make that dream a reality. You know, you guys, I really like how this, that lip balm turned my lips pink. Like anyone else notice that? Like my lips were super like ashy before. I don't know if there's like the natural color of my lips or what, but it just feels like they it gave it a slight tint to it. Like, I'm not sure, I mean, it, it's green, so it's not like it's pink, but I don't know. You guys have to try this and someone else take a picture and let me know how this looked on you. I kind of like it. It's really natural. Like I feel like if you're going for a natural look, you could wear this lip balm with like your moisturizer and some glow and you would just be good to go. Like you feel great. All right, let's try this out. So we have spa scriptions. Very cute little jar here. Let's open this up and see what it looks like and show y'all. <laughs> And you're gonna take your brush, your applicator brush here. It has the silicone on the end. This is like the basic look for a 
face mask brush, but definitely gonna be easy to clean. You wanna clean this after each time you use it so it doesn't get all clumped up, but love it. Let's try this out. Ooh, you guys. I like the way this feels. I'm not even gonna say what this looks like, which y'all already know. The only crappy part about this is it's supposed to dry like a gel, right? This is supposed to take 15 minutes. Well, we shall see how well this dries in 15 minutes because it's just so watery, like the way it's sitting on, if you guys can see, it's just going on so smoothly that it feels like I'm supposed to like rub this in almost. Like it almost feels like lotion. So now all we have to do is just wait for this to dry, which it says 15 minutes. I'm probably gonna give it 20 just to give it a little extra time to sit. So I'll be right back. So we're back and First of all, I just want to say it actually did a pretty good job. I had like a little breakout right here. It already like took the swelling down. Like I'm shook. I'm not going to lie. That was really, really good. And for $6, now I get to play around with the other ones. The charcoal for sure is going to get me excited because I really like the way charcoal feels on my skin. It just really makes it look good in the end. Update you guys. So after I got out of the shower, which as you guys can see, I've changed everything. So yeah, I just took a shower, but... I actually reapplied the Milani Green Goddess lip balm. Yo. Remember when we talked about the whole does it change my lips to pink thing? It does. I did a little experiment and I'm gonna do it for you guys. Basically clear on the lips, right? It makes you look really natural. Check this out. You see that? It's turning pink. Do it again for the camera. See that develop that's crazy amazing i'm sure but yeah i really like this this is definitely i think a good investment so far everything that i got today you guys was pretty fire i mean hello go walmart right yeah i'm gonna definitely hold on to this i love these nails you guys it's like when you get engaged for the first time you just have to just throw it in everyone's face like yeah that's how i feel right now these nails are fire but most importantly so is this lip balm but as far as like the texture of my face after the face mask it worked really well it, it did exactly what it said it was gonna do pull out all the impurities my face feels really dry though so i do need to add some moisturizer i want to show you guys another thing i got from walmart since we're on the topic of moisturizer and I need to add this anyway because that did dry out my skin just a little bit and of course most face masks do. I did want to use the e.l.f. Glow Radiant Moisturizer. I bought this a few weeks ago whenever I did my nighttime skincare routine. So if you haven't seen that video, go check that out. But yeah, we're going to use this now showing you guys what that looks like. Comes at the pump like that. And I usually add it around here i wanted to include this you guys because you can also get this product from walmart even though i didn't get it today i did haul this in a random walmart occasion so i definitely wanted to highlight it it really does look good on the skin so i definitely wanted to show you guys the outcome it does have like this kind of like coconut smell to it so if you don't like scents I said in the other video also that this may not be for you because it does have a scent to it. Just look at that glow, like, oh. Yes. This is really cute. Like, I always have to add a little bit more. So childish. It just, I just really like that glow, you guys. Like, I don't know, I'm a glow queen. I can't help it. I like the combination of the glow and the fact that the Milani makes my lips like pinker than usual because it just makes it this nice like natural like glow like I feel like I can take like model pictures or something even though I still do look busted though not even gonna cap I'm healthy and busted up now the last thing is you guys the yoga mat I'm excited I got my yoga pants on so let's do this okay you guys so the yoga mat it's called Performance Yoga Fitness Mat. This is by Evolve by Gaim, I guess, Gaim. But let's get this show on the roll.
prepare yourselves, for you shall now watch me do yoga. Aspen, get down. You're not doing yoga. Oh. Okay, here we go. I think we should start with a simple tree pose. Inhale. Okay, did that. I think we should do a couple stretches. So this is what it looks like up close. Sorry about the dog hair. That's just Aspen being Aspen. But really good texture. The only thing I really don't like about it is the fact that this edge here, the part that's more curled, which I don't know, maybe this is just the fact that it's new, but it's really curled at this end part. So it's kind of hard to like stay down, but the rest of the mat really lays down, but it's just that back piece. But I'm gonna do a couple straight. This is what happens when I get down on the ground for even two seconds. Can't help to be mauled by my own dog. I'm in the stretch right now, you guys. Just chilling. So that is all for today. As Porky the pig would say. <laughs> oh, that's all folks. AF, that yoga mat kind of wore me out. Overall, you guys, all the products I got today were super great. I already told you guys everything that I got and I'll make sure I write it in the description as well. The nails, fire. The lips are luscious, baby. Even like the moisturizer. If you like the way this looks on me and you feel like this could work for you, Go pick it up, go try it out. It's only like $8 for this moisturizer. So hey, if you wanna try it out, it's at Walmart. As far as Walmart goes, um, keep killing it, boo. Keep doing you. Okay. Kiss. All I gotta say is, what's poppin'? That's all I gotta say. Oh, lastly, you guys, if you like this necklace, I know it's new, I have just started wearing it. Um, I got this from Austin. It's amazing because of the fact that it's handmade. This was actually a painting and the lady, which her name is Claire, she has her own business. And here's also another painting that she did and she digitalizes them and gets them printed onto things. Like she had spice grinders, she had necklaces, she had cards, she had actual paintings. There were so many different things that I, I bought this from a flea market. So if you guys like stuff like this, definitely hit her up. I'll link her stuff below too. Her Facebook is Art by Aya and her Instagram is Aya Claire. Just wanted to shout her out real quick because I did really, really, really love this necklace and I got her card because I told her I really wanted to shout her out on my channel. You may not get this exact one, but you may get something really similar to it. It's really cool how they're kind of all personalized, you know, so you kind of feel like it's more special, like you're the only one that has this. But that is all for today, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next time. Love ya. Bye.